Okay, hello dear friends, good uh, morning. This is a Sunday morning, almost noon time. And uh, in Mountain View, there is a farmer's market. And uh, every, every Sunday, I try as much as I can to buy something. There is a bread shop, there is a mushroom shop, and vegeta shop, vegetable shop, I must go. And just uh, such a lovely place. And uh, I look for stories to share with people. Here I will, I will take you to a, a cookie shop, a biscotti shop. Beautiful day. It just makes you feel so happy. Hello dear friends, let me see. Yes, we are videotaping. So I have been here for a few years and see this most lovely couple and they, they just make you feel so comfortable and happy. So maybe you can introduce yourself. Hi, your I'm head. Roxanne of Roxanne's Biscotti. I've been making my biscotti for almost 30 years now and I just went into business four and a half years ago. Yeah. So we've been here at Mountain View for almost three and a half years. Yes. And uh, we started with just biscotti. Mm. We've expanded into granola, some wow. spices, and nuts. So, how, how did you get started? Did you do this business all the time, or no? We four started. Years ago? I started making my biscotti for my grandmother because she really enjoyed biscotti. But most biscotti was very, very hard and so my biscotti has a fantastic texture it's nice and crunchy uh, without being so hard you have to feel like you have to dunk it to be able to enjoy it yeah so we make uh, four basic flavors in almond anise butterscotch and chocolate chip and every week I make a different uh, nut free flavor usually bound to the season so this particular week we have a mocha that's made with Pete's coffee so we do try to keep all of our ingredients as local as possible wow that's interesting maybe you can share Share something of how you get started, the difficulty or the, the journey of your life. Let's go a little bit back. Would you like uh, the story? Why I make this video? Because each person has a story. We all have something to inspire people. So how you suddenly get this idea? Maybe you were doing something else before. Something. Well, I was. Um doing lots of different things. I did uh, craft shows, making um, homemade crafts, jackets, wow. and uh, throws. And, but I've always had an interest in food. And so all my friends have always told me, you should you know, go into business with your biscotti, because it's so fantastic. So we took the plunge about four and a half years ago. And it's been very rewarding. You know, there's nothing like making something, something that you create, and then sharing with others and seeing that join other people's faces. It's, Fantastic. Yes. yes. I have never seen you before four years ago, but I really feel the two of you, your the, your couple is so lovely. Yes, I have a great partner. Yes. My husband. Yeah. I think this is why people get back to you. You have a family feeling and it's just so good. Oh, thank you. Thank I, you very much. Thank you. I wish the best of you. Thank you. Maybe people will have had questions. I will link to you and okay. send you. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Excellent. Thank you so much. Thank there you. you. Go. Thank Thanks, you. guys. Enjoy the rest of your weekend too. Hello. Hi, how are you? <laughs> good. You eat her food? Yeah. It's the greatest really joy in the very world. Very rewarding. Very rewarding. <laughs> and I'm her biggest fan. <laughs> you are so lovely. I am. <laughs> So this is the cookie shop. It's a little bit noisy. I will see if I can make it. Uh, look at this couple. They are they are the most lovely couple. Thank you. 
place I gotta be. Thank you.